in 2003, I moved to Tampa, Florida and living here for almost 20 years, I found myself homeless on two separate occasions. And, um, uh, you know, I, I do vividly remember the struggles of what it, what it takes just to try to live in the city I call home and uh, moved away, you know, over a thousand miles from my, from my born and raised city. Um, you know, I, I was passionate, but I was really frustrated also that how much, how hard it felt like you had to work just to, just to keep a roof over your head along, let alone other things. And, um, you know, just, just having that, that, those moments happen to me and, and being able to bring it full circle, so to speak to give back in a way I, I, I can, I couldn't think of a better, a better story <laughs> to, uh, to be blessed with and, um, you know, and uh, wouldn't change it for the world as, as difficult as it is to being homeless. I mean, it's, it's what I had to go through. And um, it was a, it was, it's, it's what God uh, led me, led me through uh, to begin with, and now be blessed enough to sit here and talk about um, designing a machine um, that would literally create a home, I guess, so to speak. <laughs> if, I, if I can't think of a better thing to to have at my disposal, if I ever found myself without a home, then I could just whip out a machine and just do, 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 do. And next thing you know, I'm 3D printing a house. <laughs> <laughs> 